What's up, Internet? It's Clark here with Gamers with Day Jobs, and um, I'm going to be doing the first of a series of Let's Plays on Bioshock. Uh, it's an older title, uh, but if you uh, have uh, been listening to the podcast, first episode, which uh, should have dropped here just shortly ago, uh, you'll know why that's a little bit more interesting for me to be playing, and um, probably how poorly this is about to go for me. <laughs> so, um, let's just get into it and uh, see what happens. Uh, go ahead and switch on over here. Let's get this background out of here, too, and try and focus in on the game. There we go. So... Uh, I've played other shooters before. Let's do that. Uh, and just a little forewarning. Uh, I've been told that uh, this does have some copyrighted music in it. So, unfortunately, I have just turned the music slider all the way down. Uh, I hear it contributes a great bit to the ambiance. They but. told me. Son. What are you going to do? You're special. You were born to do great things. You know what? They were right. That's an intro. Not great, Bob. Oh, okay. This looks surprisingly good for a game its age. I was looking at the um, specs required for this uh, as we were, as I was looking into it, and uh, for a game that requires like half a gig of VRAM, this is pretty surprising. Decent looking water. That's good. Hmm. A real Iron Rand kind of vibe here. Submarine. Hell yeah. <laughs> I am Andrew Ryan. And I'm here to ask you a question. Is a man not entitled to the sweat of his brow? No, says the man in Washington, it belongs to the poor. No, says the man in the Vatican, it belongs to God. No, says the man in Moscow, it belongs to everyone. I rejected those answers. And 
Instead, I chose something different. I chose the impossible. I chose rapture. I chose to be an asshole. A city where the artist would not fear the censor, where the scientist would not be bound by petty morality, where the great would not be constrained by the small. And with the sweat of your brow, rapture can become your city as well. Okay, still just got whales floating through this underwater city. Good to see nature is unaffected. to say sweet prince wonder how thick this cloud is Thanks, random Irish guy. Don't like that sound. So, we seem to have some sort of alternate timeline going on here, and an underwater quote-unquote utopia? Hmm. 
what we got here. Told me that before I did it. It's not cool, dude. Seems like it's the kind of thing you give guy a heads up on. It's just my DNA. This little fish looks like he just had his cherry popped. Wonder if he's still got some Adam. the sound of quote-unquote metal daddy ah uh. is is the barbed wire really necessary there you think look mr bubbles it's an angel i can see light coming from his belly wait a minute he's still breathing it's all right they know he'll be an angel soon Actually seems like a decent first place for uh, our first chapter to end uh, we're gonna pick it up right back here um, I haven't gotten plasmid now whatever the hell that is stay tuned to find out see you next time